I'm going to test the SD RAM on the cat board. First I'll download the bitstream into the FPGA. And that was the test. When all four LEDs come on, that means the test was successful. That's pretty fast, so let's take a, take a look at it in more detail. When I hold down this push button, that first LED that turns on shows that it's in the reset state. Once I release that, it will go and start writing the SD RAM, and then it'll change over to reading it. And then if the what it read out of the SD RAM matches what it wrote into it, then it'll flash all four LEDs like that. So what we're seeing is that the SDRAM is testing correctly. Now you can't trust any test unless you can make it fail. So what I'm going to do is short out a couple of data pins here and then rerun the test. So it's in reset, it's writing, it's reading, and only one LED comes on, number four at the end. That shows that the test failed. So let's see that again. The test has failed. Take the knife blade away and unshort the pins. Run it again. The SDRAM now passes. So that shows that it actually is testing the SDRAM and that it's working correctly.